Hello guys, welcome to a video and today we are looking at the Stormberg. So this car can go underwater and it can literally be a submarine underwater with torpedoes and all that. So today we are reviewing the Stormberg and we'll be fully upgrading it. If you, if you wanted this car, I'm going to show you guys how to, how to drive it underwater and how to change. So you hold H to get in the water, of course, like I showed you back before. And then, look, we're just holding W to go forward, D, and then to, it's the same as a plane, but it's a bit awkward this time. So, say if I wanted to go up, I would have to go down. If I wanted to go down, I would have to go up. I know it didn't show very much, but uh, okay, so on my mouse, to go up, we have to go down on the mouse pad. So we hold W and we keep pressing D and all that because it'll just spin out. So that's us up. And then if we want to go down, we push up on the mouse while holding the left click. So you see that? See the fins moving up and down? That's what you want to see, yeah? So now let's figure out what is a better call what call could be better than this now i'm thinking like the flying call you guys have seen i made a video how simple how to fly the flying call the deluxe so we hold h here we just go back i think i did it a bit too early but you guys so we're back to machine guns now and you know it's it's quite nice. The car is quite nice altogether. It it's quite a lot of money. As if you wanted to spend that much money, it's not the car that you'd want for the money. I would say go for a little bit more money, save up a little bit more. As this car is not the best of cars unless you just wanted just wanted to go under the water and explore. But guys, I think the the <coughs> okay guys i think the deluxo is such a better car as it can not only fly but it can get you anywhere you want because sky vehicles are so much easier and if it's a flying car you can go anywhere pretty much except under the water as we test out in other video where you can't you literally floating above the water so I'm gonna leave you guys to it. What it's like inside is it's quite simple. It's got its own, it's got its own kind of way of car. If you look at it, it's just, it's a little bit like the X80 with that little dash bit there, the bit that comes through that connects to the dash through to the center rest. But it's quite the same inside. So if we go outside, um, this this is the car here. You know what I mean? It's there's not there's not much here, so I've not really did much to this car. So we are gonna go inside and look at the upgrades, all the different upgrades. I think I have up, upgraded a tinty bit, but there's a little bit more we can upgrade to it. So if we have armor, we will put brakes. So we'll put the armor to 100. We'll put everything to max. We don't have explosives, of course. Um, yeah, we got that horn. We got the lights. We want to put on the undergo. My crew, man. So, we're going to leave it white. As the James Bond underwater submarine call is white. It's quite cool. How is this gonna meant to go underwater? Like what bits come out, what bits don't? And where's the guns at? There's like no bits for guns at the front, except maybe if it's little holes here. Oh no. The guns shoot out of here. These little bits here. It's a bit weird in this light, so we'll go back outside into the world of Los Santos. So if you look here, if you wanna exit that call, um so we hold right click for shoot see so the guns come out there and 
Now, I hope you guys did enjoy this video as there will be more simple videos coming out soon. This is now a series and I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Please leave a thumbs up and I'll see you guys later. Goodbye. Spaggy out.